So hey guys, uh, so I'm me. Right now I'm in Lal Matia and uh, there's an exhibition going on. It's a small exhibition. Let me turn around the camera so that you can see. Let's see. Uh, yeah, there you go. So it's this one. It's Jugal Jorib by Moon Rahman. Uh, it's gonna take place from 14 October uh, to 5th November 2020 uh, from 4 to 8 so let's see what's happening inside so it, the place is called Kola Kendra I haven't been here before so there's so really big paintings all over the place um, as usual they are inside glass cases so there will be some reflections but I'm happy that they're big enough for me to show in the camera uh, I'm getting a kind of like a cave painting vibes here I don't know what kind of medium the artist used um, sorry not an expert in this area um, so I'm gonna switch to POV mood um, there are some PRs over here so if somebody wants to cover it uh, they will have to mention these um, there's a um, leaflet with the names of the art artist and um, the paintings um, but let's uh, let's enjoy the paintings for now they're, they're very big so I'll be able to show you clearly I guess as much as possible um, so as you can see there are lots of old figurine almost like a cave painting vibe going on uh, I can see Tagore right there uh, lots of symbolism um, sorry not enough <laughs> no don't have enough knowledge about uh, art or what the artist was trying to say over here and there are lots of colors um, like there are Lots of animals, um, bisons, and uh, lots of different figures um, uh, that have historical signs. There's a writing over here. If somebody knows what it is, let me know in the comment section. Something old. Uh, but yeah, I mean, sorry, I, didn't, I don't have enough history. <laughs> History information uh, elephants. Um, there's a, oh, that's the name of the artist. Um, this is actually a map. This is actually a map. I don't know if you can see it, but that's a map. Something about from the history. I should have known that. Um, I'll probably Google it later. If somebody knows it, please comment. Uh, but yeah, this artist have. Um, accumulated a lot of information in small canvas and it's all its history it's something to do with the prehistoric uh, world I'm guessing and as you can see there are lots of text old text maps and animals oh that's nice huh. so this is moon this is done by moon Rahman so Lots of faces, small faces with eyes, small eyes going here, not there. So, I uh, don't know what it is. Uh, also, there are no names again. Uh, usually, when uh, I used to go uh, abroad to see art exhibition, they always had names, but they don't, uh, here it doesn't have names. This looks like a uh, sort of like a pool, a water pool, like uh, I see a tadpole maybe, uh, a few frogs here and there. So it gives a vibe of life and uh, life by the side of uh, mud pot, something like that. Um, this is another by Moon Rahman and yeah, again it's it's a mermaid, I think, but uh, it's a mermaid. Uh, 
Yeah, you can call it a mermaid. Uh, let's move on to this room over here. Uh, this is again by Moon Rahman. Uh, again, faces with faces in between. So this is a big face and there are some small faces. So don't know if the artist was trying to say that there are faces within faces. Uh, that, that's going to be something deep thought. Um, again, one, another one by Moon Rahman. Uh, this is probably related to childhood. Uh, village childhood, I can see a mother and her child. So, very nice paintings. And over here, this is probably a bazaar or a market in Bangladesh. So, I can see uh, him carrying something uh, on his head. And he also has a bottle, bottle of oil there, may I say. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, this one, I'm not sure exactly sure what the artist was trying to say. Uh, it's, it gives you a spooky vibe, maybe because of this one. But yeah, again, we're uh, back to the map and symbolism. Uh, really, really wanted want to understand what kind of message the artist was trying to say. But sorry, not enough education in the history department for. Uh, me to explain these to you so if anybody knows please let me know there are two more over here these are probably by moon rahman uh, i like the fact that she's using very she or he is using big canvases uh here uh not gonna touch it but same theme a big face and within that face there are multiple faces so Let's, there's one more room I saw over here, so, yeah. These are also by Moon Rahman. Uh, interesting, this is also probably related to childhood. Uh, that's a dog, probably a pet. Uh, they're playing and there's a bird. Uh, don't know what these two figures are. Parents, maybe. Uh, here again, uh, there's uh, uh, probably again uh, something about faces. It's, uh, I guess this artist uh, is trying to say something about faces and how they change over time. Uh, I'm gonna so face to face. There's one literature you can. Uh, don't know if it's available online but probably gonna check that out and see what's the explanation is uh, there's one more again so again same theme uh, so many faces different faces with um, various kinds of animals surrounding this gives a very dark vibe because uh, it's almost like these bodies are dead and vultures are picking on them. Uh, this looks like a window somebody is looking through. Uh, here it seems like there are some children and somebody is playing a flute or something. So yeah, that's that's interesting. There's one more small room over here. Wow, oh, that's a dark one. Very dark one. So probably maggots or something coming out of the artist's face, but if somebody put it in a room, you're probably gonna get scared. Uh, and again here, uh, some faces again, green, blue. Um, all, most of these have a spooky feeling to it, interestingly. So let's see if there's any more. Oh, that's a reception area. So, that's pretty much it. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, very small exhibition. You can come here and see uh, the exhibition for yourself. As I said, this, uh, I'm doing these vlogs because I want to showcase 
as many of the exhibitions as possible is happening in Dhaka and let the world know and the international uh, visitors and uh, uh, viewers know that there are exhibitions that happens in our country and our artists are really, really talented. So um, please uh, like this channel if you like the content, uh, subscribe to this channel if you want to see more exhibitions coming on and if there's any way we can uh, improve the quality of the videos, uh, let us know. We will be happy to try it out. Thank you.